Hey, at your leisure, Nick Chase here out at Antelope Island today. Now, I basically grew up here. My mom was a park ranger, so I got to experience a lot of opportunities that most other people didn't get to. But today, I'm doing something even I haven't done before, which is touring the island on the seat of an e-bike. We're with Antelope e-bikes today, and they've got a great tour and rental service that we're gonna find more out about. Um, we started out here in 2018. We're primarily an electric bike rental and tourism company that we're, and we're located on Antelope Island right here in the marina parking lot. And so we have three different tours to select. We actually just added a fourth one this year that's brand new. And then we um, rent e-bikes by the hour. There's definitely something to be said about how different the feeling is when you have nothing but two wheels separating you from the rest of the island. While riding, it feels like the barrier between yourself and the natural world is almost non-existent. Riding the electric bikes out here is a really fun experience. Um, you know, experience in any state park is is fun on its own. You know, there's different experiences to be had, but riding um, riding an electric bike and and coming out with you know yourself or a group of people, having a tour guide to take you through everything, explain what you're seeing. Um, it makes the experience just that much more elevated and they're, they're super fun to ride like they're they're just a whole nother level you're more connected with nature um, you can kind of you know feel the breeze as it come, uh, comes along it's really nice uh, just to be closer to you know the animals and and the grass and everything um, you can stop you know on the side of the road and just be right there instantly you know you can take great pictures great uh, video right from right from your bike instead of having to view it from behind a windshield or something like that. Of course, this comes with all the beauty and mystique you can find at Antelope Island. Their sunset hike and bike tour is just one of many you can take at Antelope e-bikes, each with one of their own special aspects. It's mostly a loop, we'll go around the loop, stop at um, a lot of the uh, landmarks, especially, you know, the visitor center, we go down to the bison corral, um, and then we'll end the tour up at um, Buffalo Point, where we do a little 15 to 20 minute hike and uh, see a gorgeous sunset up at the top. I think that's the main reason a lot of people come out here is definitely the sunset and it is very hard to beat. And thanks to the electric assisted power in the bikes, it makes the activity open to everyone who has ever ridden a bike. My father recently had a little bit of a knee injury, so he's not able to run or bike as much. Uh, but I'm going to take him here to do this, because with those e-bikes, since it does so much of the work for him, we're going to be able to see uh, pretty much all of the island with the guides. We're going to be able to catch the sunset, uh, do the whole tour, without being concerned about him hurting his knee or anything. So I'm definitely going to be uh, coming back with my dad here soon. And the prime season for island exploration is just starting out, so head out there while you can. So if you go to Antelope e-bikes, um, dot com. You can go right to our website, you can book a tour or rental, and um, you can also give us a call on our phone number 801-317-8549, and we're open year-round for reservations. Antelope Island State Park sticks out as being one of the most memorable and unique places that you can visit in Utah. And it's even more of a unique experience when you ride a bike past a buffalo or feel the breeze on your face. For At Your Leisure and this week's Where To, I'm Nick Chase.